just got home and the Golden Mask 4 is waiting for me. So I'm going to do a quick unboxing for you and you can see what it looks like. Let's go. As you can see it comes in a natty Golden Mask box. Very nice. So, break the seals. Just down here. And take a look inside. See what the boys at Golden Mask have got for us this time around. Feels a bit like Christmas. So, quite well wrapped. Two pin charger, as previously with the other golden masks. I've still got my adapter, so it won't be a problem. Still haven't twigged onto the UK market yet. Small instruction manual. Receipt from M Detectors, which is who I bought it off. And uh, quite nicely packed. come out as a unit so I'll whip it out and then be with you in a second. Straight away you can see that the stem parts look slightly nicely better made than on the 3 plus and this is the lower stem is some kind of composite which is definitely different from the last one. Feels lighter as well. You can see the battery box has been slimmed down a much thinner design. That looks much better. Much better than the last one. The headphone controls got it. A little seal. Stop the water getting in. The coil looks pretty much the same. Still comes without a cover. Apart from that, that's everything you've got. You saw the little receipt in the book and the book there as well, so get it together and show you what's what. Right, so she's out of the box and put together and there's a few things that you do notice straight away. Um, first for me is that the lower shaft is quite thin and slightly bendier than the last one if I remember rightly. I've got it in two clicks and it seems to have firmed up a bit. A nice little touch they've put on the end of the wire here. They've put a little cap, a little dust cap, so that when your coil is off, it covers those pins. Great idea. Golden mask, well done on that mate. Well done guys on that. Third, I mentioned the battery box before. You can see, much sleeker and fantastic little touch here. You can open the front, remove your batteries without having to take out all the screws as you did in the others. Ten cells. They're rated at 13... 100, 1.2 volt cells, There's 10 of them, so I presume if you did go out for a mega long session without access to power you could replace them, take a spare set along with you there, so so that's the putting together of it and it seems nice and sturdy, I'm very pleased with it, one little thing I'll just show you here the way I set mine up, do you notice I've left a nice straight runner cable into the connector there? I found on the previous golden masks that if there was curve creating tension on the pins sometimes I got a little bit of interference there so I've got a nice straight run there where it connects into the back and also I've left it quite nice and loopy down on the end so that I can adjust the head without putting any extra strain on the cable as well um, standard sort of velcro ties there just to hold it tight to the stem when you once you've fixed it and you're happy of it's only a quick setup this time um, you can see no coil cover as ever might make one myself might do spray some something on there just to protect it a bit as well and here we go with the business end you can see here quite clearly you've got power level you've got discrimination level You've got audio frequency, ground balance, auto or manual ground balance, the low battery lamp. You've got your audio or multi-tone switch between the two on your discrim. Your volume, exactly where it was before. And a nice 
another nice little dust cap there for your headphone socket so if you are using it without headphones there's nowhere any dust or water can ingress so yep very happy with the old Golden Mask 4 and um, I'll be doing a lot more with this machine I'm going to be doing some testing with it I'm going to be doing some demonstrations with it and you're going to, you're going to hopefully see a lot of it because I'm hoping it's going to be a cracker